But this map could be the best in the game, but it's not because it has something called white lasers. Basically, uh, the, the devs said that there are so many lasers on this map that sometimes it bugs and it just spawns in as a white laser instead of a, you know, your, your color laser and you can't see which color laser it is. And in a game about dodging lasers and going through lasers, you could see how that might be uh, bad. But I don't think it happens too much on this map. And it's really good. It, it's, this map is just so good because it's just, oh, it just has everything. It has power-ups, it has the four spawn. Uh, the, the spawns on this map are here, 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 and here. And it has the, it has good power-ups. It has a, a vast, vast uh, majority of power-ups. There's like a lockdown, there's a stun, there's an escalate, there's a divide, there's a, that's it, right? Pretty sure. Um, and yeah, that was, it's very good in that sense for spawn with the uh, powerful power-ups. And it has a resetting lasers. So like the, the Wakas, the, the Pac-Mans, some may call it, uh, always reset. So they always just go all the way across and then they're there again. So it's very like, uh, a lot of this map is about the Pac-Mans, but they could change at any time, basically. Uh, and then the middles are the only, the only lasers that are just, just static, I guess. Uh, and those are important for like getting control over the, the, the power up locations. Uh, especially the middle one, but they're not as important as, uh, as the Wakas that like block your path. So it's, it's, there's a lot to think about on this map and a whole round has passed while I was explaining the map, which is a sign for a good map. But basically it's a good map. Uh, it's, it's, it's what I'm trying to say. It's a good map. And then I'm pretty sure he goes back to snipe. He does, yeah. But now let's actually look at the, the gameplay instead of, instead of talking about the map. Ooh. Hell yeah. You baited me in to get that Waka and then you snipe my ass. Let's go. Let's go, Zeke. Good bait. You want to go for the, uh, the, the middle of the two that spawn because they will block the, the power ups, uh, eventually. Um, so it's, it's a little bit better to, he runs into a, a laser there. That's unfortunate. They will block the, the power up locations better than the, the outside ones. So it's better to go for uh, the, I guess the center most ones of the Wakas. I mean, I go for a bounce there. Stop going for bounces, man. It doesn't work, please. I mean, I, I know it looks sick and oh my God, he runs into a laser again. He actually snipes back into a laser again. You gotta look out for like what lasers are yours and good places to start. And honestly, sometimes you just don't snipe back and just let it run out because you could do that. You could do that, Zeke. And that's totally fair if you do that. Posturing, this is, this is where the stun spawns in just a second. So I start to, uh, to go for it after this spawn it that's unfortunate but he can't kill me so we're safe and now the divide 
The divide only uh, affects the middle three lasers, the static lasers. That's what I'm talking about with the white lasers, by the way. Um, but yeah, basically, uh, you could just go for the, the power ups. And now after this divide, the power ups are the only thing that matters. Only thing that matters. So go for the middle lasers at this point, especially, especially the middle. Z gets that nice. He knows to go for the middles. And now uh, lockdown spawns. The lockdown is actually the longest in the game. Ooh, good bait, good bait. Very sick, very sick. I had one timing to get out of that and nothing else. And I missed my timing and then he got, he got the kill. Very nice. Trapped me. That's what I'm talking about, Zeg. That's what you got to do more. Okay. Well, it was a nice snipe, but I mean, eh, I don't know. If you got that far, if you got that far into the, into the map to, to get the lockdown and then you die like that, I don't know about that. Um, basically I would say go for the, the centermost uh, Pac-Man instead of the outside more. Prioritize those a little bit more and you will see a lot better results. Even though that was a really good map by you. Very good, very strong. Good control over the, the stun, which got me uh, to go in bad positions. And I mean, yeah, that was good. That was good.